More rain is expected in the flooded regions of Missouri and Illinois. Forecasters say heavy thunderstorms could begin today and last through Thursday. Sections of the Missouri River crested at 11 and a half feet above flood stage yesterday. The Mississippi River is also running at 10 times the normal flow. Here at home, no rain yet, at least uh, not today. But lots of sunshine, Tom. Yes, lots of sunshine today, Kathleen, and probably quite a bit of sunshine tomorrow as well. And we'll check that rain out in the Midwest uh, in a little bit, uh, looking at our maps to see what's happening there. 53 out here tonight, and I dare say that old thermometer tomorrow will be up close to 80 degrees probably here. Um, maybe a little cooler uh, because we're close to the lake, but nonetheless, tomorrow is really going to feel warm for the first time in a long, long time. We're going to be feeling like summer is here. 62, or rather 52. It feels like 62 out here. 52 in Buffalo right now, 54 in Niagara Falls, and in Centerville it is 50 degrees. Our dew point tonight comes to 43 degrees, 70 percent humidity. The barometer is steady at 30.22 inches. Wind out of the south, southwest at 8, and no rain for us today. Shall we look at some temperatures? All right. Dayton is 51, it's uh, 50 in Jamestown, 50 in Alden, Danville is 49, Elfred also 49, 51 in Barker, 53 in Tonawanda, St. Catharines at 52, Corning at 51, Friendship is 49, Perry is 50, 51 in Depew, Port Colborne is 52, Silver Creek is 50, Erie 50, and in Toronto it is 53 degrees at this hour. A high temperature today all the way up to 63, 48, the low this morning, 36 in 1990, 94 in 1911. Talk about extremes there, 94, 36. To the clouds tonight, and there weren't many today, and there aren't many tonight. There's some clouds that'll be moving in from the far west tomorrow, some high clouds, and maybe bringing with it a thunder shower late tomorrow night, very late tomorrow night. But in the meantime, just another great day tomorrow with warming temperatures. Some storms are boiling up here once again, the Mississippi Valley. Uh, places where they do not need the rain. We watch it coming across Kansas and into Missouri, and right there you can see more rain is being deposited in an area that does not need it. Up in the upper Great Lakes, some rain is coming through that area and probably will be moving into the western New York area late tomorrow night. But in the meantime, high pressure system stays in control for a good portion of the day tomorrow. A warm front comes through. Here comes a cold front that will be changing things just a little bit for later tomorrow night and into Wednesday. For Wednesday's forecast, that cold front will be pushing through the region. It'll take with it the showers and thunderstorms, and then a bit of a cooler, drier air mass starts to move in. Now, we look at our 6 to 10 day, uh, six to ten day temperatures. Look at that, normal, and that's something we haven't seen for a while. Tonight's lows, well, close to the 40 degree range, 40 to 50. Tomorrow, into the 70s, and maybe even maybe even some 80s away from the lake. All right, here are the forecast then for tonight, a low of 44, mainly clear, and southwest wind at 5 to 8. Tomorrow, high of 78, but cooler at the lake shore, partly sunny, south wind at 12 to 25, and for tomorrow night, a low temperature of 60, thunderstorm possible late tomorrow night, southwest wind at 12 to 25. Long-range forecast now. For tomorrow, a mix of sun and clouds and 78 and 60, warmer warmer as you get away from the lake. Wednesday, early sunshine, then the chance for showers, 78, 52. Thursday, chance for some early showers, then back to partially, partially sunny, 70. And then on Friday, partly sunny and 70 degrees. And on Saturday, look for sun, clouds, the chance of a shower, 72. Now it's way too early to really go into that uh, long range forecast for the weekend, for the holiday weekend coming up. But there could be some showers starting out on Saturday. But 72 and 56, not bad. Noticeably warmer tomorrow. Once again, our temperature is at 52 delightful degrees back inside. Oh, that's wonderful, Tom. I'm glad you like it. Thanks, Tom. Have a nice night. Coming up in sports, the Western Conference Finals tip off tonight in San Antonio. Will have the highlights from game one. And the Rangers and Capitals look to bounce back in their playoff series in the NHL. We'll tell you how they did. Coming up next in Eyewitness Sports portion of Eyewitness News is brought to you by Tops. Tops never stops saving you more.